Hi everyone, hope you are all doing well and I know I haven't done a Dollar Tree haul in a while so just wanted to come back today and share with you all what I found. I have still been uh, shopping but just have not had time to do a haul video. But before I get started with my Dollar Tree haul I just wanted to do a quick friend mail um, and shout out uh, to my friend here on YouTube, Corey Scherer. Uh, she was really nice to send me a couple of items and these are two of the microfiber cleaning cloth. I have been looking for this forever at my Dollar Trees and none of them have it and I don't think we'll ever get it. So you guys all know I love Hello Kitties and of course I always need something like this for my uh, cell phone and my iPad. So thank you so much Corey for picking these up for me and to match with that she also gave me this Hello Kitty screen cleaner. So I think this is super cute and I am very, very excited to use it. So thank you so, so much, Corey. If you guys haven't checked out Corey's channel, please make sure you do so. She does a lot of haul videos. Um, she's very crafty as well, does planner videos as well. So please make sure you check out her channel. I'm going to go ahead and link it below. Um, but anyway, let's get started with the haul, shall we? Um, the first item that I picked up that I was really excited about is this jewelry organizer and I actually found this near the cash register in their uh, rack with no with random items and gift items there and I thought this is so cute this is um, kind of like shaped like a tree and as you can see there's like little holes on it for you to put your earrings you can hang your bracelets and necklaces and then some heavier items you can put it at the base so i thought this was a great find it came in the white and the black and i went ahead and got one so this is how it looks like when it's assembled together isn't it super cute so it's plastic it's not the best material the base was a little bit hard to put on and not sure if it's quite sturdy but anyway I still thought that that was a great find for just a dollar so that was one of my uh, exciting finds for the haul and let's go ahead to some Christmas items I was really excited to find this this is the uh, wall uh, Kind of a plaque or decoration that says all hearts come home for Christmas which is really true and I love the red and white combination you see this is actually like chevron here and there's lots of glitter snowflakes very very pretty and of course uh, each piece is attached by the string so it's really really cute I went ahead and got that I also got this um, tree skirt which is the 18 inch one so it's for the small trees and I thought it's really cute it has uh, the red kind of like tinsel like glitter combination with the fur there so it's great because I have a lot of miniature trees and it would be great to switch those out I also got this uh, reindeer this tinsel reindeer and it's in the gold and red combination I thought that's really cute and I also got the sled as well uh, last year I picked up a couple of them as well in the penguin in the uh, snowman and I think there was one more I want to say it was like a Christmas tree but this year I wanted to add these to the ensemble so went ahead and got those I thought those were really cute and I didn't pick up any stockings but I sure wanted these Santa hats with the Star Wars theme on it so they are super cute this one right here has the few characters it says merry christmas and then this other one uh is also star wars theme in the blue color and it says happy holidays so my boyfriend and i will be wearing those to take pictures for christmas i think it'll be a lot of fun i also picked up stickers you guys how can i leave dollar tree without any stickers got a whole bunch and these were the christmas ones that i picked up i didn't pick up all the designs just the ones that i wanted i did skip on the sticker books but these are too cute to pass up these ones are the ones with the penguin and the polar bears and look at this one with the snowman look how cute he is so chubby and there was another snowman one but it wasn't as cute as this one so I like this one more this one right here I, I love the uh, kind of the silver foil material with the Christmas tree combination and then look at this one you guys the gingerbread lady and gingerbread man so so cute so I went ahead and got those Christmas stickers 
I also got a few packs of these because I've been uh, on the hunt for these. I think these are a great deal for a dollar. These are the Light Up Icicles, and it comes with six of these batteries, and I'm excited to try them. If they do work and they light up, we know how expensive icicle lights are, so if these work, I will be very excited to decorate them in my house. So I went ahead and got four packs of them because only one in my store had it, and it was almost sold out. The next few items that I got are these inflatable characters. Now, I did pick up some of these last year. have to admit, they were not the best quality because some of them, they just started deflating because there were actually holes in the rims of the character. So they just did not last long at all. And I was really disappointed because they were really, really cute. Um, however, I did have a penguin one that is super cute that lasted during the holidays. So I still have that one. But these were the new designs that I saw this year and wanted to give it a try one more time. If they deflate, they deflate. They're only a dollar. But this one right here, is in the owl and then there's the reindeer and i think these would be really really cute together in a group when they are inflated so i am excited to see if this actually works um i went ahead and picked up two types of treat bags i didn't want to go crazy but i just had to get this one look how cute this is with the reindeer and the snowflakes so it has the beer and snowflakes. I think this is so cute. This is like the um, sandwich bag type with the zip seal. And then this one is the one with the Santa Claus. And I just had to get it because of the fox. It's so cute. This one comes in a pack of 20 and this one comes in a pack of 30. That's it. I'm not getting any more of those treat bags <laughs> from Dollar Tree. A uh, couple more Christmas items. I went ahead and got uh, two of these card games. Now, I'm not intending to use them as card games, but I really liked the designs on the cards that I feel that they would be great for crafting, for card making. For those of you who do pocket letters, it'll be great for pocket letters. But this is the Goldfish game but I know it looks like it's all the penguin which already is super cute but I like how they have different pictures on the back of the card that you can use um, I was planning on cutting them out and uh, I can do, make them you know for cards or if I want to do any projects with them candy canes and then here's another penguin look at this hot chocolate so I really like the pictures on these cards so I thought they would be great to you. So again, for those of you who do pocket letters, I think these would be great um, to decorate them with. So that was one set. And then the other set is the Santa one, which also comes with different uh, pictures. Let me go ahead and take them out. So they look like this. So I'm just going to spread them out really quickly just for time constraint. So you see all the different pictures that are available and that you can use. Um, I also picked up a couple of Elf on the Shelf products. I think it's super cute. They had a lot of these hardcover notebooks. I went ahead and picked up this design just because he's in so many different poses. Very cute. And look at the backside with the Christmas trees and the presents. So I thought that was really cute. Um, I got one set of this. It's the pencil and eraser set. And then I got this one, which is the uh, multicolored ink pen and this is the design I picked so again all of these came in multiple designs but I only picked up one of each of those designs I also got these ornaments now I didn't pick up a lot of ornaments from the Dollar Tree just because uh, they're just not the type that I really like but I did like this one because it's a three-dimensional snowflake and it has the little bells which I thought is very nice very simple but cute so this one comes in a two-pack and then I also picked up this box that's shaped like a house. I do have a few of these from last year. And I just wanted to add this one to the collection that I had because it has the reindeer. And I think the reindeer is really, really cute. Uh, last year I picked up one with, I think, the gingerbread house and um, a couple of other designs that were really, really cute. And I kind of made it into almost like a town looking setting. So I just wanted to add this one to it. I also picked up... Um, a pack of these LED lights. It's only 10 in a pack, but I know if I don't pick these up now, I'll probably regret it because they'll be gone, but it is the one that is battery operated. 
and these are shaped like the stars. So I'm gonna give those a try and see if it works well. The last two Christmas items I got were these two rolls of Hello Kitty gift wrap. Now it is quite long, it's pretty big, you guys. Um, and I do apologize, you guys, for um, the shadow or the glare. It's just really hard for me to get good lighting at my house so um please bear with me i hope you guys can see the items okay uh but look at this you guys it has the hello kitty designs on it with the stockings the snowflake very cute and then this one has the hello kitty print all over it these would be great for my niece's presents i'm gonna wrap it i think i'm gonna get the star wars ones too for the boys but when i went to the Dollar Tree today I didn't see them so I probably have to go to another one to get those okay on to a couple of other items like decor items I picked up this beautiful jar right here with the handle and it kind of looks like mercury glass it came in the red and the silver but I thought it was absolutely beautiful so I just had to get this it definitely looks like it's more than a dollar very very pretty and then I did get two framed art I usually don't really get framed art but they had a lot in my store this weekend so there were two that caught my eye I didn't have time to go through all of them but these were in the front so I got this one right here I absolutely love the color on this one you guys I love the banners and it also has glitter on it I don't know if you guys can see it um, again I turned off my flash so that you guys don't see the glare so much but I love this very very cute and then the other one that I got that caught my eye is this one in the gold and pink combination. You guys know how much I love gold lately, and this is in the gold glitter, and it says love is all around, and I love how the back is so simple yet pretty. It's the uh, baby pink color with the chevron print. So I went ahead and got two of those framed art, and... What else did I get? Okay, on to a couple of beauty items. I didn't pick up a whole lot. I was excited to find this lip balm, and it's shaped in a lemon. Look how cute this is. Now, this also comes in the shape of an apple and strawberry, but I wasn't able to find those in my store yet. I was actually really surprised to find this because as I was getting ready to check out, I saw someone dump it by the end cap, and they decided to not take it, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm going to take this. It was the only one, so I was really excited to find that. Hope I'll be able to find the other ones um, next week and I found some elf products this one right here is the HD blush and it's the headliner one so I'm excited to try that and then I got this moisturizing lipstick in the rosy go round and you guys can see that color right there I don't know if I'm gonna keep this yet or give it for friend mail but I thought these were great finds for a dollar each um, I was also excited to find these. These are the Provincia hand creams and body lotion sets. Now these remind me a lot of the NOLA brand, the NOLA brand uh, that came out at the Dollar Tree last year. It just gives me that boutique-like feel to it and I really like that. So I use hand cream every day and carry hand cream in my purse all the time. So I went ahead and got this set. It's the almond milk hand cream. And then this one right here is the three-piece body care collection. And it comes in the shower gel, the body lotion, and the body wash. So three sets. I also got this body spray. I'm on the hunt for the hand soap. I really like hand soap, so I hope to find the hand soap. So I did pick up this line. Uh, to try so that was all the beauty items not really exciting in terms of beauty finds this week But anyway, these are new and I was excited to find them I also got this a car freshener It's from the Bahama and company air freshener and this one is in the surfboard now. This is kind of summery I don't know um, if I'm gonna use it yet, I might save it for next summer to use instead I don't know if it's gonna last that long, but I actually I'm looking um, for the flower one with the clip And I haven't seen those in any of my stores yet, but they finally started getting some of these Bahama and company in So I'm hoping I'll see them soon at my store speaking about uh, You know the Star Wars theme earlier. I picked up the six pack of tissue I think my boyfriend would love to have this <laughs> so it has the Star Wars theme on it. So I'm going to give these to him because he's always asking me for tissue. And then on to some crafty items, you guys. I picked up some 
confetti. I have a project that I want to do with these uh, sequins and confetti. So I got three packs of these sequins. The first one that I picked up is this one with the pink and purple shades. This one is in the gold and bronze like shade and this one is in the blue and green. Very, very pretty colors. And then this one of course is in the stars. And then you guys... I stocked up on stickers. They had a lot of new stickers. Uh, the first set that I got was these ones right here with the different sentiments. I love the way that they're written. Very, very pretty. So uh, these would be perfect for cards because it looks like you're using a stamp, but it's actually a sticker. But it also comes with these little really cute stickers as well. So these ones have like the clouds and the rainbow on it. This one with the theme faithful, adore. It has the stars. I love this one as well. Very, very cute. Um, and it has the hot air balloon, stars, and the sun. This one is very girly. Beauty, pretty, cute, smile, imagine, dream, fun. And these ones have the heart patterns on it. This one, happy, wish, enjoy. It has some emojis and happy faces on it. And then the last one is uh, precious, baby, cute. So it has all these musical notes and flowers on them. So that was the first set that I found. I also found these. These were new in my store as well. These are what they call labels and it comes, this one comes in a 30 pack and it has all these like little speech bubbles in different colors, thought bubbles, speech bubbles. So it comes in two sides. I got that design and then this one's really cute. This one, it has like the little paper clip as if you're paper clipping it. This one would be perfect for the journal actually. So I got this one. And then this one's really cute as well with some fruits on it. They also had some different ones with like animals on it, but I think those are more for kids. So I didn't really like those as much. Um, so I passed on those. I also got these ones, which are kind of like the handmade kind, the scrapbooking kind. And I thought they were so cute. This one comes in a pack of 12. Look at this one with the coffee mug that says happy birthday. And this one says cake with a really, really tall candle, has the cupcake, birthday hat. I really like this one as well. It says party, special day. Very, very fun. This one says I love you, hugs and kisses with the key. So this is a, like a love theme. And then these two right here are the baby theme ones. I just think they are so adorable. And then, uh, like I said, you guys, I really went crazy on stickers this time because they had a lot. I got this pack of Star Wars stickers. This one comes in a pack of 96 of them. And then these two were new as well. So this one has all these forest animals, which are super cute. Look at the owls. Look at the raccoons and the squirrels and the fox. Really cute. And then this one, I think I ha I might have had it before, but I went ahead and got another pack anyway because it is so cute. So those were the sticker finds. And then on to a couple of food items. We are almost done. I picked up two of these Gavalia iced coffee uh, almond milk with the caramel flavor because I picked up the mocha and the vanilla, but I, fi I found another store that had the caramel one. So I went ahead and got the caramel one. I was really excited to find this. This is the Chips Ahoy limited edition chocolate banana. Like, um, it's it looks really good, you guys. But the store that I found it in, they only had three packs left. And I got this one because this is the only one that didn't look like it was open yet. The other two looked like it was open already. If not, I probably would have gotten another pack. I also have seen a lot of you haul these, and I wanted to give it a try. It's the Cambridge and Thames Italian Cantuccini with almonds. I do like almonds. And I don't know, it just looks really yummy. It's something that I can eat as a snack with my coffee. So I got that. And then you guys know this is a regular. <laughs> this is something that I pick up all the time. It's the Lance Toasty crackers in the peanut butter. And then last but not least, I picked up this desk calendar right here. I love the simple design to it. I love the size of it. I don't like the kind that's too too big um but so this size is just right and i know if i were to buy something like this at target it would probably be three dollars so i did like this pattern and um i went ahead and got it for a dollar so that was my haul you guys this is collective over the past couple of weeks and um hope all of you enjoyed it i really appreciate all of your support love and comments and uh, thank you to all my subscribers i really appreciate it and for those of you who have not subscribed yet if you like uh these 
these haul videos, please go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe button, and I will continue to do more of these haul videos for you all. Thank you so, so much for watching, and love you all so much, and I will talk to you all again soon. Bye!